All right, fun fact. Uh, I don't watch a whole lot of TV, but I do, I have watched over the years a series. It's a re reality TV. It's totally real. It's a, it's a show called The Bachelor. And uh, my wife and I have watched it pretty much from the first season on. And I showed another video about a month ago of another person who came in uh, to our office and we meet the most interesting people uh, and, and one of the nicest people I, we've met in our practice uh, was on reality TV. He was the actual bachelor. And his name is, <laughs> is Brad Womack. Hello, everybody. I, uh, you're being way too kind, by the way. <laughs> I think Dr. Wong is the superstar here. So anyway. Um, Can you tell me what you had? What, what, uh, what was the problem you were experiencing? Mm -hmm. And uh, what were you trying to accomplish? And what did you have done to do that? So my eyesight far away was perfectly fine. Um, but up close, I couldn't read a single thing. And I'm talking restaurant menus. If I was working on the computer, I needed readers couldn't read a magazine to save my life and frankly it was a little embarrassing when I was out with friends and had to ask for recommendations on a menu because I literally couldn't read it and so I let it go way on or for uh, way too long uh, Austin and I and especially Dr. Wong came very highly recommended I uh, just had the procedure done Monday and then Wednesday meaning left eye right eye and my vision is now 2020 and Dr. Wong and his staff are all my new best friends. I'm telling you, it's been a life-changing experience. So he had uh, he had premium lens replacement with the panoptics lenses in both eyes. He basically could see just fine far away, and you just use reading glasses, right? Yes, sir. That's what it was. But yeah. thing is, I couldn't go anywhere without reading glasses, and now I, uh, I haven't even picked up a pair this entire week, which I'm telling you is life-changing for me. So I, uh, I owe you a lot. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yeah, this is seriously one of the nicest guys. <laughs> we love him. Okay, thank you, Brad. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.